welcome back to the channel so I have my fire going outside for my fajitas and for breakfast we're having cinnamon rolls oh yes I gotta put the icing on them now So this is the steak, um, not steak, it's a skirt steak, um, but you make fajitas out of it, and what I did was season it with some steak seasoning, and, and then I put Italian dressing on top of here, and I let it marinate overnight. So the Italian dressing just tenderizes the meat and gives it a little tang to it also. And today I'm going to help my friend finish moving. During the flood, she and her family were flooded and they have to move from the house that they were renting to another house. Okay, family, my coals are nice and gray. And so now I'm about to put my fajita steak on there. Oh, look at that. Mmm. So we want to hear some sizzling sound. Let's drip off the excess of that. Let's put it on here. Oh yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay guys, so I have it in there. You can see the smoke. Oh yeah. Coming up out of my little smoker. So, we're going to have some fajitas. So, while I was out here, um, I know a few of y'all have asked about my plants. So, um, as for my patio garden, how is it going? Well, let's show you. <laughs> okay, these are my tomato trees, as usual. So, when I was talking about, I've been having like the little bitty green balls, but they really haven't been doing much. There you go, right there. I don't know if y'all can see them. There you go. Um, it's kind of changed a little bit, but not much. And um, so that's all I have for that. And then over here, my okra have been doing good. There's a couple more that I need to start getting out of. But there is an okra up there. Let me point with my little thingy. You see it right there. And then there's one, and we come down here, and there's one hiding back there. There he goes. So my okra is doing very well. They are producing, you know, a few on each bush. So that is, it is doing very well. Um, here is Lillian. Look at Lillian. You remember this plant that I rescued from the, um, let me move my tongs out the way, um, that I rescued from the dumpster from the lady that passed away. Look at Lillian. She is growing. Yeah. She's doing her own thing. She don't want to be bothered. <laughs> um, let's see. What else? Sorry, guys. Um, my pineapple tree now guys i grew this from just a cut off of the pineapple at the top and look at this this is almost three years now we're close to the three year mark and it has sprouted out far these leaves are big um we still have my honeydew no cantaloupe down there it hasn't done anything it's just growing vines but it's cute because i love just greenery <laughs> So I'm not concerned about that, but I do want to show y'all a new thing that's going on right here. Look, look at my little garden, my little nest of green beans. Now, at first I planted these tomatoes, super cherries. Yeah, they didn't do anything. <laughs> they, they didn't grow, like nothing came up. So then I stuck in some garden green beans these right here 
and um, they are coming up. Yesterday they were just barely above the ground and now look at that. Wow. It won't take long. There's some more coming up right there. Yeah. So I will have... Now these green beans here are the bush beans. Now before, uh, last, uh, earlier in the summer, I did the, um, the vine ones. And I did get some, but... After seeing Frank's bush beans, and he was saying bush beans are better to grow, I was like, that's what I'm going to do. I'm about to do some bush beans for I can have green beans throughout the winter time. But look at them. They're so cute. Okay, guys. So here's that skirt steak that I had on the grill. Look at that. That looks nice. Look at that. Ooh. I'm going to cut this bad boy open so we can see what it looks inside. Alright family, here is the final results. We have some that is medium and medium well. Um, yeah, look at the season on that. Man. Oh. It's going to be good. I'm going to grill up some onions and I have some flour tortillas. And this is going to be lunch. I'm going to take it over to my friend and her mom and her little daughter. And um, help them move the rest of their stuff. Guys, have us in your prayers as we um, continue finishing up cleaning up her house. And getting ready to move her to her new home. So, alright guys. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, I wish you would. I would love for you to join our family. Hit me with a like on this video, guys, and I'll see you on the next adventure.